steps we need to take. But first of all, I think we have to introduce this beautiful, sweet baby right here. Yes. Who is this, Missy? This is Roxy, and she is a six-month-old Maltese Shih Tzu mix, and she is just as sweet as can be and loves to play. She is and so give kisses. cute and loves to give kisses. I said, for a puppy, she was so calm. And, and Missy said, she'd been running all morning She's with all your dogs. She's been running all morning with all, the, all my crew. She's been playing hard. Yes, but she is a pretty calm puppy. So. Yeah. yeah. Good for kids, then, oh, in yes. family with kids. Great for kids. Mm -hmm. All right. If folks might want to adopt her, how do they do that? Yes, uh, they can email us at buddiespromise at gmail.com. And uh, so we will send them an application, and we will check referrals and make sure we find her the best forever, po forever home possible. That's what you do every day, yes. isn't it? Well, let's talk about the, the steps to becoming a foster parent for uh, one of your little yes. friends. Yes. Um, Buddy's Promise, we don't have a bricks-and-mortar complex, so we rely heavily on people that want to help us uh, pull dogs from different kill shelters and place them in their homes as a foster. And when you foster a dog, uh, we pay for all the medical um, treatments or anything that needs to be done. We just ask that you, you know, if we have a meet and greet or something set up, that you make the dog available, available to us so we can find the perfect home for them. And how can people see all of the pets that you have in foster care and say, well, I really want Roxy? You can go on our Facebook page. Um, it's Buddy's Promise Forever Home. And then we're also in the process of setting up a pet finder page and well, working on a website idea. as well. Yeah, very good. So what are your responsibilities? You, you do the medical, is the feeding and... What? Yes, yeah, so basically just, you know, make sure they're fed and water. If there's some type of issue that comes up, immediately text me and let me know. So if we need to get them into the vet to take care of any medical issues that we can do so right away. Is there a length of time that is typical for a foster situation? It just depends. Like for her, she's going to go quickly. She will. Uh, so she's at my house. We have a meet and greet set up for this weekend. But, um, you know, others might be a hospice case where it's foster to hospice. They're older and they've got some medical yes. issues. So, you know, that could be anywhere from a week to six, seven, eight months or possibly years. Do we need any training, Missy, to be a foster parent? You just need to love animals. You know, just want to give them a home. And a lot of the ones we pull are from different situations where they've never had that human touch or love. So, you know, just acclimate them to being a dog again. Well, it would also help them, I think, get ready for a family, yes. too, if you've got somebody to love you and it does. make it does you feel help at them. home. How can people support your efforts, Missy? I know this is not free. It's not. They can, uh, you know, buddiespromise at gmail.com. They can always call our vet and help pay for vet bills at Allbreed uh, Pet Care in Newburgh. But we've got a fun event coming up in Ellis Park uh, where they will be allowing us on August 3rd to set up some booths. We'll have our Buddy's Promise t-shirts, some other items available, and several other um, rescue organizations will be there too. Paws will be there, Buddy's Promise, Another Chance for Animals, Feline Fix and New Hope. So come out, enjoy the wiener dog races, and then help <laughs> support hilarious. these possum rescues. That is hilarious. Yes. And it's August 3rd from August when to when? 3rd, um, 10 to 5. 10 to 5. At Ellis Park. Do we need, if we decide we want to adopt that day, we need to come with cash? With the Please come and we'll have you fill out an application. Uh, we won't actually adopt on the spot. That day. Uh, because we do check references. We're pretty pretty picky and thorough about making sure we find the best placement for our rescues. Well, that's good to know. It is. That's good to know for the, the pets as well. Well, Roxy, I just feel pretty sure. Can we get one more shot of Roxy here? I mean, yeah. can you get another close up? There you go. I feel like Roxy's going to be find a home before the weekend is out. Missy, thank, thank you so thank much. You. For what everything. You do. Roxy, thank you for being adorable. <laughs> and speaking of adorable, let's check in with Ron Rose. No, Roxy's the adorable one. Yes.